When a phantom itch leads to a fatal system error, or a body installed at your own risk, available only on Brain Dance. Good evening, Night City. My first guest tonight is the Look, president of the church. Forgot earlier. A runner I know has something you could probably use. Zip in your deeds. Praise be to thee, our Father in heaven. And our second guest is host of the chip in program which promotes the use of cybernetic implants i love treating you beautiful can't complain ziggy thanks for having me now i'd like us to talk about the most exclusive and highly sought out oh, stupid gates busted again third time that'd be some kind of scam I'm gonna have a word with this super oh yeah I might have caught something when I jagged into that corpo's biomon. Don't know, uh, neurovirus, or... I need to see Vic. Let him tell me what's got my head reeling, my stomach churning. Okay, let me take you. I brought you a ride. Yeah, throw in some threads, meet me downstairs. Jones here. If you're looking for work in Watson, give me a call. How'd you find me? How'd you even know my name? I know where to gather my intel. You could even call me a collector. Later, V. Inspection has shown many have been corrupted. So you are embarrassed. Police experts have confirmed the identified virus can lead to cyberware failure and, in extreme cases, even death. In response to increased Today, 
Thank you, Rise, you fucked up, man. Oh. <laughs> Rough night. Could always be more. Trying to chill. It's too loud for you. Just lock the meal. It's not that. What? Hey, yo, V. How about a round or two? What do you say? How you like my new punching bag? Just gave me a next-gen ass whooping. He did. Be curious to see how he handles the likes of V. <laughs> so how about it? Let's do this. Light on your feet. Get that head moving. Sale. Only top shelf gear. You mentioned something about fighting. Mm. I've seen you land in blows in the ring. You've got sharp instinct, good edge. You can go far, especially if you get chipped. These fights, let's just say they aren't legal, but very lucrative. Yeah, lucrative for who? You or me? Both of us. I get a small percentage of the total winnings, you know, as your agent. You get the rest. Sounds fair. It's like I said. Good instinct. Fights happen in different parts of the city. You choose where you want to go, put down your eddies, and start swinging. You win, you take home the pot. Manage to drop every last one of them, you get a chance to fight in the grand finale. That all clear? Crystal. Good. Oh, except you won't be setting foot outside or once. Not yet. You can start in Kaboom. I believe in you, V. Time to show this city what you're made of. Festival is nearly upon us. To mark the event, the streets of Night City will come alive with exquisite multi-story dashi floats. The festival program will also include musical performances by Biwa virtuosos and theatrical performances in the No tradition. The sponsor for the festival is the Arasaka Corporation. And in an exciting development, even Hanako Arasaka has announced her participation in the Dashi Parade. From all of us at WNS News, we wish you a safe and fun Matsuri. Enjoy yourselves, Night City. After the break, cyber psychosis with a reality. So... Mm. Man of the hour. <laughs> Sheesh. Took you long enough. Worked up an appetite, just waiting. 
Sit down. Let me finish this. Then we can drop in on Senor Vector. I mentioned something about a surprise yesterday. Am I remembering right, or just had a brain fart? Probably both, because you usually forget shit. But it just so happens, I think I might have bagged us a sweet-ass J-O-B. Go on. I mean, only the top fixer in night fucking city. Fat-ass black cheek. So what's the gig? We meant to come out in one piece? Our Lord and Savior wants to tell you everything himself, face to face. Oh, no pressure, but uh, this whole deal, he's riding on you now, I see. Why do I gotta go? You and T-Bug draw straws without me? T-Bug and Dick. Look, V, it's his job, his... Guess I got no choice then. Dex is a real deal when it comes to fixer. Not really, no. It's always the same story. You land on fresh turf, local fixer waves his dick around, but he's smiling, saying you'll be up to your neck in gigs and eddies. Still, all you are is another name in their little black book. Nifty tool for getting them a fat slice of whatever half-baked shit pie. Sure, you crack jokes over drinks, but in the end, it's biz. Gracias, adios. Estoy lleno. Brought your wheels. Thanks, Jack. Much appreciated. Some top-notch work Miguel did. Rides like it looks. Factory new. We'll see about that. So we rolling or what? Let's feel this factory new ride. First stop, Ripper Duck and Holmes. Easy on the gas, huh? I just ate. I was supposed to stop by Vicks anyhow. I got a date, me and Miss D. You don't say. She's so sweet. Really gets me, you know. Sit tight over here. Me and Misty got a little kitchen up to do. You look pleased. Cause I am. Always. Makes for easier. <laughs> Tell me about your fantasies, honey. Vicky, surprise everything. The old Ripper, it's good to see you. Good to see you too, V. Oh, wow. To what do I owe the pleasure today? Last gig. Had to jack into a client's neuro socket. Think I might have gotten spiked. Experiencing migraines, nausea, hypersensitivity to bright lights. Old kit and caboodle. All right, kit. We'll sort you out in a flash. Besides that, how are things? Need some new kit, but tools, not toys, Vic. Time I bumped up my sights and got a grip. 
<laughs> really? Now? Finally? Vic, shit's getting real. Got a job from Dex to Sean, hitting the major leagues. Need tech that could perform. The Dexter Deshaun? <laughs> well, that is something. But let me guess. Hasn't paid you yet. Quit crying, Vic. I'll bring you the Eddies later, with interest. You know I will. Hmm. Last time, you hear? Chair, please. Sit down and relax. Kuroshi Optics. Best I've got, and should be about right under the circumstances. Now check in. Kuroshi? Whoa. Vic, nothing tops that on the market. Hmm. Sounds like it could come in handy, then. I gave you my word I'd pay you back, but this... might be too rich for my blood. We'll work something out. Right now, I'm just out to make sure you get back in one piece. Eddie's in hand. You peruse and choose while I scan. Let's see what's going on inside. Mark one, like I said. Decent enough scanner. Displays data on your cornea. Cherry on the top's a built-in external lens disruptor. In layman's terms, any surveillance cam will capture your face as a blur. And just remember, your body will still show up as crystal clear. Hmm. This should do the trick. Talks to Kuroshi Tech, too. I'm ready. Carve away. Excellent. Let's do this. Lay that major league arm of yours right here. Just like that. Thanks. Now, a bit of anesthetic and I can start cutting. Feel anything? Play by play, though? Really, Doc? Makes it sound like a dentist. Always going on and on. Don't be mean now. Remember, I'm old. I got a shaky Gannick hand. Could slip. Lights out for a minute, all right? Okay, let's test this. See the magic in action. Linking you in. You might feel a little discomfort at first. Blurred vision, low contrast, glitches. Well, how's it look? Feel all right to you? Oh, this is fantastic, Vic. <laughs> oh, beautiful. Time for the scanner. It might take you a few seconds to adjust. But first time's rarely the charm, <laughs> with anything, really. Scanner should eventually sync with your thought processes and read your intentions. I also inject an NCPD file search. Run into any ne'er do wells? <laughs> you know exactly what they ne'er did well. <laughs> I 
It ought to work like a charm. Now draw your weapon. You should see your ammo count in a brand new sight. How about the neurovirus from the last job? Can you check it? Done and gone while we were putting in your implant. And a full sweep on your soft and circuits. Zap the critter. You're certified bug free. Shit, Victor, not bad. I don't know what to say. Say you'll take this and remember the dosage. Two whiffs now, and another two in an hour. What am I looking at? A mild stim. Should boost neurotransmission in the short term and muffle some of the side effects while the implant takes. Thanks again, Vic. You're the best. I owe you. Go on, kid. Show them what you're made of. And once you hit the big leagues, don't forget where you came from. For you, but you'd have to watch out for negative energy fields and avoid mean reds. Anything red. <sighs> Thanks, Misty. You're the best. And your aura. It needs tending, baby. You gotta brush it daily. It's just no good if you don't. Make sure your hands are clean and caress the filaments of light along their length. V, yo, listen up. I talked to Dex while you were in with the doc. He's waiting in his ride. For you. Ain't but a hop to where he's parked. Next to Gramsci Burgers. Okay, do my best to talk us up. How's biz, Misty? Booming? Hmm. You're the first person to walk in here for two days. And two days ago, it was a pizza guy. Got lost. People in this town, they've lost their spiritual connection. But well, you know, I'm here to serve them, not the other way around. But you are not the master. Hey, listen, of your I've got this delicate your matter. That's why I called you. you the number of cyber psycho attacks in the not city is on the rise. Now that's probably not news to you, but this issue matters to me for a few reasons. There are people who say cyber psychosis can be treated. Right. And I know exactly how that sounds, but I believe even an unproven therapy is still better than a bullet to the brain. If I get a tip about a possible attack, I'll give you a call. Maybe you can investigate before Max Tack hits the scene. But remember, you're not there to execute anybody. Try to incapacitate the attacker, and I'll send someone to pick him up. I hope that's all clear. Mr. V, a pleasure. Dexter Deshawn in the flesh. Ample indeed. <laughs> Let's roll. Mind if I ask you something right off the bangle? Would you rather live in pieces, Mr. Nobody, die ripe, old, and smelling slightly of urine, or go down for all times in a blaze of glory, smelling near like posies, without seeing your 30th? Some sort of test? Eh, just a pet topic of mine. You mean... riddles? No, Mr. V. Ontology. All right, listen close. Scanning a serious job now. 
plain gargantuan compared to smashing up a scav home. Hang on. I got a question of my own now. Why all this, Dex? Why me? Could have had Jackie or T-Bug sitting here. Could have just done this on comms. Call me old-fashioned, but I like to look anyone I do biz with in the eye. Had the pleasure of meeting the Jackster in the past, and sweet T-Bug helped this brother out two years ago. So here we are. Besides all that, Got a special little pre-mission just for you, but we'll get to that. Let me hear it. What's the job? There's this prototype tech, a biochip to be precise. Job's to grab it. Simple. Yeah. <laughs> Guessing it belongs to a corp. Mm-hmm. Arasaka. Surely that's no problem. Corps don't deserve special treatment. Shit, <laughs> you ain't playing around. Got a feeling this could be a start of a beautiful friendship built on heaps of eddies. You work this out? Got a plan? Two things. First, a conundrum with the Maelstrom boys. Needs active resolve in that. Second, a rendezvous. Simple. Client who brought us the job's anxious. She wants to parlay with one of the team. What's the issue needs resolving with Maelstrom? Got a beef? Slot in the shard. Got a classic tale for you. Psycho gang doing his thing two weeks back. Jumped a Militech convoy. Got away with the gear. Corp don't even know Maelstrom's involved. Now see, convoy was carrying the flathead. A little combat bot, a prototype. And I need me that bit of high-grade military tech. Because if we don't get that bot, we don't get no soccer chip. And we sure as hell don't get no happily ever after. But don't get excited. It's a single-use toy. Now, I flat out purchased the damn thing from Maelstrom. Problem is, I did so from a gent went by the name of Brick. I say when, because Brick was the leader. Three days after we'd sealed our deal, his friend and gangmate, one Simon Randall, AKA Royce, plain dropped his ass. Royce is in charge now, and I got no way of knowing if he aims to honor his predecessor's word. To add to this shitstrom, one Meredith Stout of Militech has developed an interest in said convoy. Who's the prima donna? Corpo agent, internal affairs. Been skidding around town asking after the convoy as if her life depended on finding it. The one lead she's got zip tied in her trunk. Stick up her ass ain't growing any shorter, so she must be getting desperate. Be wise to think how you could use that. Of course, to do so, you'll need that frazzled cat's info. Sending it now. Client, what's her thing? Why she need to meet? Woman's name's Evelyn Parker. Betting her wasn't easy. Put the word out I was looking for any kind of intel. Right, and? Some brothers from Pacifica got back to me. Told me to stop looking. End the convo. <laughs> anyway, our little client insisted on meeting someone with skin in the game. You know, who'll be there for it all. Yours truly will be remote. T-Bug ain't no people person, and Jaggy's only good at some things. I know you know what I mean. Pretty much leaves you. I think I got everything. Time I got to work. Well, that's just music to my ears. I'll set up the meet with Miss Parker at Lizzie's bar. Flathead, though, is gonna be all you. One more thing, Mr. V. Quiet life or blaze of glory? Hmm? Later now. Jackster, talk to Dex. 
Cortito's a big deal. Literally a nod. Guy certainly knows how to protect his biz. Wants to put us in a few small kinks. Prep work, I guess. Before lining us up a big job. There's this combat bot, military prototype. Maelstrom clept it. Then Dex paid to take it off their hands just before the gang goons had a switch up in management. I right, heard about that. Royce versus Brick. Hostile takeover. That sums it up. Dex wants us talking to Royce. Gave the deets of some Militech agent, too, but... I don't know how much help she stands to be. Ha. <laughs> Chingon. Then there's the other thing. Gotta meet the client who put the job on the table. Evelyn Parker. You? Well, what's Dex gonna do? Ride around in his limo, check checks up on the hollow? Parker wants to meet someone on the crew. Dex gave me the nod. He must know what he's doing. So, how you wanna play this? Maelstrom or Parker? What's first? I say we knock on Maelstrom's door first. Pound, actually. But I live. In that case, I'll hit the all foods and put my nose to the ground. Ground. Hasta luego. Heard you misplaced a convoy. You shut him up. Spill what you know. Don't make me wait. Nuh-uh. Not on the horn. Let's meet. Cut a deal. A deal? Fine. First exit off Skyline, driving towards the NID. Storm channel under the overpass. What? Huh? People, fucking run! <laughs> <laughs> Lively. Meredith Stout. Take it you were the one to call? That'd be me. 
thought you could blackmail me, fucker! Set conditions! Got any more for me? Calm the fuck down! I just want to talk! Christ, Meredith! Shut your trap! That fucking thing ready? All set. Now answer my questions. Honestly. Forthrightly. Are you here alone? <laughs> yep. Just little old me. It's the truth. Do a sweep, now. Now listen, close. This piece of shit, Anthony Gilchrist, is he your contact? Is he the one who leaked intel on the convoy? That guy? Never seen him before. Checks out. Listen, I know where the transport is. I can help you. Just want a favor in return. <sighs> I told you! I fucking told you! I'm not the mole! Jesus Christ! Shut him up! Unhand me now before I... Ugh. Him you can let go. Want to hear what he has to say? You know, I could help patch the gaps in your convoy security. Prevent a repeat of this fiasco. Nope, not interested. Let's hear your offer. I don't have all day. I need a bot. Flathead model. Guys who ripped you off have it. Promise me that bot. I'll point the finger. You have a plan how to deal with them? Could just take it by force, but they're expecting payment. So I could go that route too. Fine, the latter. But on one condition. You pay with our money. Sounds solid enough. I'm in. You pay with that chip, and that's all you gotta worry about. Try to fuck me in any way, and I'll be seeing you real soon. You're making a mistake! The cunt's already gonna dead! The she'll take you down with her! There you are. Let me hear what you squared away. Then an arch? Oh, damn. What a beaut. Yeah, got her cheap, too. Dorset job dividend. Hmm. Then I could scrape together enough for that beast. Even used. Well, I, I took out a loan, but muy pequeñito. But I mean, it's totally worth it. So Dex already paid the Maelstromers for the Corpo bot. Thing is, can't be sure the Gangoons are still willing to hand it over. He paid up front? Híjole. Well, whatever. Let's go get this tech. You skin yet? You got a plan? Hello? Militech and me, we found some common ground. They're footing the bill for the bot. There's a lot of scratch to toss away. Get it, Jack. We'll be like we never had it in the first place. Anyway, who knows how this deal's gonna shake out. So, into the Borg Beast den? 
Let's go see these bastards. All right, let's knock on their door. 